me. The beta is here and that means very soon after you will get a live update, maybe even when this video goes up. So let's check out the unlocks. We have defeat 100,000 enemies in a single run with Queen Sigma, reach level 99 with Clarity, <laughs> complete the collection, ooh, let's take a look at the collection, we are currently missing only one of them. So I would say to complete the collection we do a hurry mode run. So first of all we have to reach level 99 with clarity, shouldn't be all too hard. Let's go for max weapons too, hurry mode on the library and wicked arcana. Garlic, hey you are who I was looking for. Thank you. Spinaccio, Ken Labrador, Santa Water. I, oh, I was about to say, I would like to have a garlic upgrade to one-shot them, perfect. Attract orb to be lazy? Sure, why not. More Santa water. Santa water yet again. Skullomaniac. Ah, isn't garlic a beautiful weapon? Just look at this. The simplicity. Torona's box, because why not? And Torona. Crown is the last one that I'll take, and now we will pick up Empty Tome. Wouldn't you call us lucky? There's a vacuum. Thank you for the level ups. Oh, minute 6 might be a rough one. Is it looking good? I'm scared with the curse that I run through. I, oh, oh, oh. Ooh, yeah, with the curse it's spicy. It's fine if I die here, I think. There we have the grove. Let's pick up the experience. Um, yeah, Toruna, sure, Toruna, sure. And Toruna, and banish Toruna. You know, the extra curse is nice, but I think it was a little bit too much. And now we are heading into limit break territory. Minute 8 and minute 9 are just farm waves, that means even with full curse, we are more than fine. Unless center water has a gap. Experience, 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 experience. Oh my god. We are already almost there, level 72, just a little bit more. No, 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 stay away from me. I don't want the chest. I want to keep my center water. Thank you. Silent Old Sanctuary has a lot of damage and cooldown. Pool party, pool party, pool party, pool party, pool party. This should do the trick, let's see. Uh, yes, there we go, level 106. And quit. We got the Arcana, Divine Bloodline. And that is a hardcore one. So we should have the full collection. Someone said that you also need all the secret characters for this to work. I don't know if that's true. But to unlock this, let's just go in, let's quit. And there she is. Queen Sigma. She costs zero gold. That's quite a cheap one. <laughs> we unlock her and we can see... Oh my god. God, let me just quickly reset the power-ups. So she has 108 reroll skips, banishes, bonus of 50% luck, 10% curse, magnet, I think that's more, right? Yeah, that's more. Revival amount, negative 25% cooldown, duration might, move speed, wow. Recovery is free and, oh my god, she has so much HP. That is more than red death, wow. So I read that you can't buy eggs on her, I just want to quickly try that out. Let's go to Moongolo, that is the easiest one. Oh! Wait, you can buy candy box? Wait, what? But that is unique to her, correct? Yeah, interesting. Oh, that is cool. A at the same time, wait, but can you farm golden eggs? How would we test this? I want to see if we can farm golden eggs with this or not. So I think we want to go to Moongolo. We will pick up the Mad Groove. There we go. And... Ooh, that weapon is amazing. That's a lot of fun. Hello. Hello. How do I kill him now? Huh. I didn't think that far. Oh, look at this. I just got another Arcana on the very first level up. Wow. Okay. Uh, out of bounds, I think I only have one weapon that will be good. Okay. Empty Tome, Duplicator, Spinaccio. I don't want any of these, so I will just use one of my 113 rerolls. There we go. And we have another Arcana. 
Wait. Uh, I went for out of bounds, I just realized. <laughs> Silent Bolt Sanctuary. There we go, crown. Doesn't really matter. Doesn't make a difference. Let's get this one as well. I don't think I need anything else. Yeah, there we go. Okay. So how much damage are you doing? Um, it doesn't look like it's a lot of damage, but it attacks incredibly fast. Okay, interesting. Victory Sword fires one more projectile. That will be a very good test. Oh, the out of bounds just nuked everything with the freeze. <laughs> That's kind of hilarious. So when does it do the pew, pew, pew? Is that the evolution? How do we even evolve it? Well, this run here is just to test if we can get golden eggs. This is not the, oh yeah, let's test the weapon and everything. I think I'll take this. Empty tome. Can I maybe get another freeze? I really like this nuke everything with one freeze. Um, Crown, sure. Maybe I should also get attract orb. No, we want to limit break the weapon. I want to see what's in there. Victory sword, base damage up by 5. Base area up by 20%. That is actually a lot. Yeah, that is a lot, a lot. So all in all, the character is incredibly powerful, but as we have seen, we can't buy golden eggs, and that is a problem. Like, even if you could farm them with the guardians, this will take so long compared to the other farming methods that you have nowadays, especially people with a lot of golden eggs. They farm so many golden eggs per run that, like, there's no way you could be faster if you do any other method by killing enemies. The weapon is really interesting. It is so satisfying. You just can't see this. Oh my god, it's already at 60 damage. Look at this. Oh my god. Wait, what? What? Do you? Huh? It shot away my golden egg. What is going on with my stats, by the way? So, I got 100 HP. I got 0.5 regen. I'm pretty sure I got armor. I got 10% movement speed. I got a lot of might. I got a lot of duration. Did I lose more cooldown? We also got luck. Uh, growth, I'm... That is... Currently plus 16% to the 15%. Uh, it looks like we also got growth. The rest looks normal. We definitely got rerolls, skips, and banishes. So I think it's determined that this character will not get any golden eggs. That means the character has to be very strong. Let's play Sigma. She owns everything. We will limit to three weapons only. And where do we want to go? I think Dairy Blend is in general a good one. There are a lot of very, very useful items on the stage. Let's kick it off with Wicked Season, but after that we'll go for Divine Bloodline. Okay, there we go. What we are looking for is Retaliatory Damage. That is a perfect one. Yeah, let's take it. So, Divine Bloodline, armor also affects listed weapons, but these are all unevolved weapons, that is very important. Damage and reflects enemy damage, character gains bonus damage depending on missing health, defeating enemies with retaliatory damage gives plus one max health, perfect. Now the weapon attack itself counts as that, as you can see, I have 463 damage right now, so let's bump this up a little bit. Uh, actually, we need something, there's Heart of Fire. So, to show you, let me just walk around, we have 473, what we need now is pretty much just touch the enemy. It looks like the weapon has retaliatory damage either way on its own, like even without Heart of Fire. When you touch them, then it just attacks them. Now, to explain the Arcana, and this will take a little bit longer, what do I actually want to go for here? Armor is on the stage, I guess we go for spinach then, but this doesn't make a big difference later on, so I will not care about it. We just got plus one projectile on the sword. So the way it works is the game applies a bonus damage based on 50% of our armor. And this brought something to my mind. A character that gains a ton of max HP and armor on certain levels. So the first benefit of the Arcana is that the bonus damage that we have seen is 50% of our armor. That was very good to know. But it's only for the listed weapons. Then we get a bonus might that is based on our max HP minus our current HP divided by 100. In other words, that means the more max health you have, but the less current health you have. So the lower you are, the more might bonus you will get. And as you can see, it's right now 133. If I would take a lot of damage right now, this would jump up. Then enemies that touch a character, they take damage equal to 100% of our armor. That is a lot. 
and any enemy that we defeat by retaliatory damage, while we have this Arcana, gives us one max HP. That is, that is actually quite a lot. Oh, I didn't want to do that, but thank you for the chest. I would have liked to keep that. Ah, it's fine. So, retaliatory damage is a little bit confusing. Let's quickly take a moment and just talk about this. The Divine Bloodline Arcana Touch damage is retaliatory damage. The No Future On Character Explosion. The Heart of Fire Arcana On Character Explosion. The Crimson Shroud On Character Explosion, but there is no other one. And the Victory Sword On Character Trigger. And that is the reason why I have Heart of Fire right now. However, I will not go for Fire Wand. Because the weapon itself doesn't get a benefit from it if we evolve it to Hellfire. The retaliatory damage is only on our character. Now, for no future, we have to evolve it and get the weapon. Because otherwise, you don't get the effect on you. And that is the reason why I have it right now. But technically speaking, if you would want to take this to the max, then you probably would only use the main weapon. But for this, I have the Limit Break series. And there I will do it. So I'm currently thinking, what passives do we want to get? Spinach is one, Skullomaniac is one, Crown is one. Is there any other one that we need? I'm not too sure about this. We could also get the uh, Heart, the Hollow Heart maybe, for a lot of bonus HP. But the best effect would be if you could do this at the end of the run. Like on Mad Forest, you have it on the floor, and then you just pick it up. Yeah, that would be better. But we can't do that here. So, Victory Sword is still damage. At the end of this, I will list all of the level ups. The Cheetah Shooter on Discord made a very nice summary. Do we want to go for Clover? I don't know if this affects anything. I would assume so. Ah, we will have more than enough luck, right? I'm actually right now looking at everything that we will have. And I don't want to have this. But I will take something else. That is an old-time friend of mine that I haven't used in a very long time, pretty much. Now, right now, we already have three Arcana. Spoilers. There may be more, but the bets that are on the floor, they will not give us any arcana. That is because we already have three, and that is an important difference, because technically speaking, if you wouldn't level up, then you would still get the arcana. Now, that is obviously very, very complicated. Plus 10 damage, thank you. But if you were able to somehow do that, that you don't level up, then you could get a lot more arcana. In fact, in total, seven. Uh, I think I want to head over to this dude here. Let's get the candy box and I will just get the laurel. There it's finished. Toruna's box. And maybe I should get going. No armor, not yet. But yeah, maybe I should get going and pick up this stuff that I want to have in the future. Tiragisu. Well, I will not pick them up right now, but in the future. We have Victory Sword, level 11. So far, we haven't activated anything special. We have the critical strikes that it does, and this is where the flashes are coming from. Very nice. Those are really big. Can Labrador... Ah, I will pick you up soon, but not yet. Laurel Spellbinder, Victory Sword level 12, and this is the max level. So let's quickly go over this. The first time you level it up, you gain plus one amount. Then you gain area and base damage. Then plus one amount. Area and base damage plus one amount, area and base damage at level 7, so this repeats three times. At level 8, you enable the critical hits and the combo finisher. The combo finisher is this vertical line that you have here. Uh, yeah, sure, let's get the bonus curse. Very nice, thank you. We actually want the enemies to touch me, so I'm a big fan of that. At level 9, you gain 10 bonus damage, which is quite a lot. There's crown. We are settled. Nice. We can finally do something. So, how about we get an evolution? And just to round it up, at 10 to 12, you lose 0.25 seconds of cooldown, which is good. You know, it's, it's less cooldown than it takes. Okay, I, I had quite a few level ups here, it looks like. Are you ready to rumble? There we go. Look at this. Soul Solution, Gift of Victory Sword. The more enemies are defeated, the stronger it grows. Nice. So we have to defeat 100k enemies to unlock the... Oh my god. Oh my god. That is so beautiful. I'm stuck. Step bro. I'm... I'm... St oh. oh okay. all, all is good. That is so beautiful. Dude, I love this. I can't... Oh my god. What triggers you, by the way? 
It is this down here, but it didn't read anything. So, the pool limit of the weapon is 100. I don't really know if this means anything, because, like, it, it's just an animation, right? I don't know if it actually does something. The cooldown is 20 seconds, the duration is 10 seconds. The interval is 0.1 seconds, that's probably how quickly it attacks. Then it has no knockback, the damage is 10. Interesting. I wonder if this is base damage, because that would be multiplied by 10. And the hitbox delay is 0.1 seconds. Okay, that is all not too important for you, but it's good to know. Uh, where's the wings? Down there. No, very, very interesting weapon. Looking at the damage that it deals, it actually looks like the base damage is 10 in the game. So, yeah. That is exactly what I was reading right now. Oh, where are the wings? Give me the wingers, Maximus. Our HP is 1.5k. Are you kidding me? <laughs> it just keeps triggering. And I don't see anything. Help. Oh, you can't... Oh, wait. I'm invulnerable. Yeah, nothing can happen to me. I can't even pick up stuff while that's going on. I kind of wish you could also walk through blocks. But I guess it would be really weird if you walk through blocks and then suddenly you come out of it and you're stuck inside of a block. Not even step row can help you there. This is just amazing. I'm just constantly look. I don't even want to move around. I don't even want to do anything anymore. The only thing that I want is, I hope, that it's affected by our cooldown reduction. And I just want to have Silent Old Sanctuary and take this to the max. Wait, hold on. Silent Old Sanctuary actually takes it to the max. Negative 90% is the max cooldown and it will give us right now 8, 16, 24%. Oh my god, I will get that. Guardian, you try to face Hoa. Uh, Hoa. Uh, Ah, uh, ah, uh, go away, go away, go away. How much damage do I take? Um, well, it's a lot. 1100 might. Okay, that is, why did I even go for spinach, by the way? Didn't I say that spinach doesn't really make sense? Not that I need another weapon, but I guess for duration it would have been cool with this effect. <laughs> oh, this is something else. Okay, here we go. Let's go into limit break territory. J just do whatever. I don't care too much. I will quickly pick up everything that I can pick up. That means I will just rush through these. And we mainly need armor to evolve the rune tracer. And then we also need the arrows to evolve laurel. And then we are happy with the limit break stats. We are just killing everything. Let's go ham. So how much how much might do we have? 1.6k. That is um that is something else. And it looks spooky, right? It looks like we have no HP. But keep in mind right now we have roughly one fifth of our HP. That is 400. Now uh, close to 400, you know. That is a lot of HP that I have right now. Now it doesn't help against Red Death because Red Death has an incredible amount of damage. 65. Okay, yeah, that will not happen. Okay, this is um, this is a little bit complicated to walk through the enemies. Dude, just imagine, because Crimson Shroud is such a perfect weapon for this, it will constantly go off. Wait, did I miss the Ken Labrador? Yeah, I did. But Crimson Shroud only has retaliatory damage. That means there is no other bonuses than getting the max HP bonuses. That means there are no other kills, but from the, the retaliatory damage, you know, which gives you HP. Like Rune Tracer, for example, whenever it kills right now, it's not a bonus, it doesn't do anything. But if you have Crimson Shroud, that thing will go crazy. Okay, let's head over there. I really chose the worst map, didn't I? <laughs> I, I decided to go to... I, I didn't know that this happens. Like, I knew that the effect will happen, but I didn't know that you don't see the objects anymore. And I decided to go to the worst map that has objects everywhere where you can't walk through. Ah, it's just Dex moment. So once we have the armor, we can finally evolve the Rune Tracer. And that means we can go ham with Limit Break. The Laurel will not get any Limit Break stats, so we don't care about it. Crimson Shroud will gain Limit Break stats, but Laurel has none. So we can't waste any on an unevolved weapon. Why does this feel weird? This doesn't feel like I have 110% movement speed. That feels like I have way less somehow. I don't know. Maybe I'm just used to way more at this point. So we said that we want to go for Silent Old Sanctuary. 
Another one that I kind of want to go for is Awake. Uh, but for now, let's go for Silent Old Sanctuary. Yeah, sure. So at level 77, we got our fourth Arcana. As you can see, this has nothing to do with the Arcana chest at minute 11. That is just a typical level up that this character has. Well, not typical. They are unique. Was there a boss at 9 minutes? I'm not too sure. But the armor is around the corner. There it is. Hey, hey. Ah, don't hide yourself. Come out and face me. Uh, you're not facing me. Thank you. So is there a boss at 9 minutes? I hope. I don't think there was one at 10 minutes, but at 9 minutes. I thought I saw a boss. Oh yeah, there we go. Nice. Welcome. No future. Now it's time to go ham. Now I can upgrade everything at any time. I mean, I could do this prior. I'm talking about the limit break stats. But, uh, yeah. But I was obviously wasting them on the rune tracer, which I didn't want to do. Ooh, this is just... Wow. So this character is obviously meant to be just completely bonkers and busted. Now we kind of have to differentiate a little bit what happens on the character and what happens with the... 3k might bonus, okay. What happens with the Arcana? Since, for example, the might bonus is coming from the Arcana, right? As well as the bonus HP is also coming from the Arcana. Hey, 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 go away. Go away. Give me the silver ring. Uh, now we need... Uh, I think I will just pick up the Attract Orb. I prefer having just stupid fun in these videos when I have update videos instead of going for the super try-hard, do-the-best method or whatever. Wait, what happened to the NFT? Didn't I get this? I should have gotten it right. Oh, now I get it. That is so interesting. Okay. Won't this make it near impossible to pick up all the gems while I have the might bonus because this will constantly go on? Oh, that is interesting. I didn't even consider that. But at least we are halfway there to do 100k kills to unlock this weapon on any other character. Dude, you can make such amazing builds with this. Let me add down here. The arrow is the last one missing and this will allow me to evolve Laurel. And also for Laurel to receive bonus stats from the limit break. It, it looks so scary the amount of HP that I have. But in reality we just have so much total HP. It, like... I wonder if No Future somehow applies the max HP bonus with its normal attacks. No! Wait, that is actually perfect. But I- No, I got bumped into a corner, really? Uh, yeah, right before the growth bonus. Go ham. Wait. Oh, there we go. Oh my god, we reached level- what is it? Level 108. This is where you can choose the last arcana. Now, I was actually thinking about this. We have crit here. And we could crit for a ton of damage with our might bonus. Aside from this, awake would also be good because we gain one armor. And to be fair, I will take awake just for fun. Because what I want to do is, whenever you die with awake, you gain 10% bonus HP. And that happens at the very end of the game, when we have the most HP possible. There's the guardian. Gimme, give gimme, give gimme. Give he just died. W what happened there? I don't have Shroud yet. How did he die so quickly? What is my HP? 13,740, okay. Alright then. Alright. Um, yeah. Yeah. No, that, that is normal. Th that is normal, guys. 3.5k. Wait, how much bonus am I? 15,951. 15,951. Okay. Wait. I guess the character has bonus revivals, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, where is the... Okay, I'm looking for the gem. Where are you? There you are. Is this the big one? No, it wasn't. So it almost looks like you have to do... Wait, but I think I pick up the gems the moment I pick them up. This would be good to know if it counts as them being picked up, but I just don't get experience yet, and it applies the growth when it was doubled, or if it only applies the... Oh my god. If it only applies the moment I, yeah, actually get to collect it. There we have Crimson Shroud. And I will also pick up this chest over here. I think this was the Arcana chest. But as you can see, we got nothing out of it. 
That's just how it is. Um, didn't we, didn't we, didn't, didn't we just check this and it was at 16k or so? Okay. Um, uh, I'm not too sure what to do right now. <laughs> I think, oh, I'm missing the track orb. Yeah, let's get the track orb. Wait, is this the big red gem? Hold on a moment. Hold on a moment. Let me get a grove. Um, it was a big one, but I don't think this was everything. Wait, wait, wait. No! Wait, yeah, but I don't know if this already applies it or not. Huh. Oh my god, the amount of level ups. No, I think this was with growth doubling. But this would require some testing. Come on, where are you? Vacuum! You belong to me. Well, that's an attractor, but it's the same thing. 55,000! Who needs eggs? Who needs eggs? Who needs eggs, right? We don't need eggs. This is fine. Wait, wait, wait. Is there a way to test if we get max HP from no future? Technically speaking, I think we do. I'm not too sure. This could also be our main weapon that's just killing something. But looking at how much the no future is attacking, I actually think we do. I would need to test this with pretty much only having no future. That would be the only proper way to test this. But, the, boy. Boy. We already have the 100k kills, by the way. In fact, we had 125k. Well, grow, 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 grow. Gimme, 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 gimme. No! I'll just pretend that it still works. I don't even know if I found the red gem. There are so many red gems around. Let's see. Do we get a bad load of level ups here? Oh my god, there we go. Keep going. Keep going. Keep. No! Why did you stop? You should have continued, my friend. The thing is, this map is not the best one for the highest level. That would be library. But I was tired of library. I do all of my videos on there for the fact that it's the best one to gain levels. And I thought it would be nice to see a shift in color. So I decided to go for gray. <laughs> That's not really better than, than just brown. But I guess you see different enemies, you know. And it changes a little bit. Okay. Um, yeah, I messed it up, by the way. Give me all the curse. I know this is just completely busted, okay? There is no benefit or challenge or anything in this. But you know what there is? A chest. No! Pain and suffering. There is pain and suffering. Press escape to skip. It doesn't work on these. Ah! Ah! You used to be the best part about the game. Now you're the worst part. What was I talking about? Oh yeah, you know what there is? This, this, and this, this! 75,000 might, 77,000 max HP, 7 revivals where we will gain bonus HP. Ah! Ah! Nah, for real, it, 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 it's completely busted. <laughs> like, I mean, I get the, the, the extra. I wonder how much gold you could farm with this character. The amazing part is that you can just pick three Arcanas from get-go, right? So, you know what you could pick? Wicked Season, Gold Fever, and then you could go- Oh my god, I'm gonna make a guide on this. And then you could go for Silent Old Sanctuary, for example. And I think this will be enough. You don't need more, probably. I heard that the weapon can even kill the Stalker on the Bone Zone, and this was the only problem. That means you're set. You're set for life. Just have fun. Enjoy it. Just go crazy. Or, or have an epileptic shock, you know, because uh, <laughs> there's a lot going on. Like, the next character that comes out is probably just a character who crashes down a meteor and destroys the entire stage. And all the enemies that spawn, they just fall into a black hole. And you're just floating around and, and I don't know, eating garlic? Yeah, sounds, sounds reasonable. So I would say if, without further looking into this, Probably the best gold farming method is kick it off with this character, just go he just go crazy with the gold arcana in the beginning on the bone zone, farm a buttload of gold, and then you put this all into trouser, because trouser should still be by far the best one. His scaling is just way too good for this, I believe, I think. Like, the thing is, this character can't have gold next, right? So no matter how good the character is, technically speaking... Okay, you could make it really broken. But technically speaking, no matter how good this character is, it shouldn't outscale the bonus that Drowser gets. Maybe not on 100kx, maybe not on 500kx, but definitely eventually. 
I I'm just making up random numbers, by the way, to get a point across. I'm not saying this is the case. Uh, and come on. Do we have a red gem around? Any one of you want to donate me their choosy gems? Oh, 516. Can I somehow maybe take damage? <laughs> I want to have even less HP than I have right now. Uh, yeah. One that I would have really loved to take is just Slash, but like, we don't even see what happens, right? Yeah. Who needs Limit Break for no future if you have this going? No, Limit Break no future is a lot more fun. Okay, we will have a ton of level ups here. Again, I don't know when it's collected, but I really hope it was collected. Oh my god, let's go. Come on, come on, climb. Nice number, but that was not enough. We need way more. Way, way more. Now this is the sad part, in the library at 28-29 minutes you would go mayhem. You get so much experience there, however, we have the wave 28 here, it's a lot worse, but wave 29 is almost as good, and we will get a ton of experience. Go, gimme, 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 I need more, gimme all of it, where is it, where's the red gem, don't, it's fine. Again, still don't know how it works really. I just realized, if I am fast enough and don't forget about it, when I die at the very end, then I can press escape. So if I don't fail to do this, after the reaper kills us, then I can press escape and we can check out the max HP that we have there. Boy, I'm so excited to see what HP we will end on. Sadly, no hollow heart. This would top it if we were on mad force with the hollow heart on the floor that we can just pick up at any time. But Jesus Christ, this is insane. 220k kills, yeah, that's fine, that's fine, yeah, yeah, all good. I kind of have a semi goal right now, I want to one day just break the might, but I don't think this will be possible. I don't think there's just enough of anything for this on this character here, since you can't get the golden axe, right? Yeah, that's a little bit sad. However, wait, that is, th that doesn't matter, I just realized, because you can do this on any other character. Like, I can do this on my smith, for example. Will I actually farm more gold next, just for this again? Ah, oh. Do you guys hear any sound? I, I, I sometimes hear pew. Oh, 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 uh-huh. Game, what are you doing? Okay. The Grove is about to happen. I should be able to collect this with the Grove. The problem is I don't see the red gem. Let's hope it was here. I think I got it. So, no, this looked like a normal amount, right? Like the one that we usually get. So I think it's safe to assume, but not guaranteed, that when I pick it up or when the gems disappear, this already counts as collected, but it just doesn't do the XP applying yet because we are invulnerable. Hopefully. <laughs> the no future is doing 35,000 damage right now. I think it is no future at least. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it is. The thing is it could also be our sword, our main weapon, but I don't know. Wait, wait, wait. I saw 16,000 over there to the bottom right. And I saw starting 6? What? That must be the critical strikes. Okay. Um, 17,000 and 36,000 and something with a starting 6. Weird. I don't know exactly what belongs to what there. But uh, yeah, no, it makes sense. We have the crit, we have the sword, we have the vertical explosion, and we have rune tracer. Shroud is not being triggered, so that doesn't matter at all. No, I just realized we can't die. We can't die to the reaper. Wait, but we will die to the white hand. All is good, all is good. Just imagine the white hand moves in, and we just disappear into nothingness, and nothing happens to us. Ugh. <laughs> uh. And we hit the 1k. I'm pretty confident we will hit 1k at least. Not now, but once we hit 29 minutes. So the problem is I have a ton of pickup range. And there is a vacuum to my top right. I would like to see it. Did I... What just happened? I think I picked it up. No. Listen, I have visuals turned off. Maybe, no, I want to keep them on now for the rest as well. Uh, if I was a vacuum, where would I be? I mean, there's one up there. Yeah, let's just head over there and let's just get it. Here, give me all the stuff. There, thank you. 
I will head to the one solo vacuum up there. Okay, yeah, I'm heading. The problem is at this point I can't even see anything anymore really because of no future. Why is no future going so- oh, limit break. Yeah, okay. Yeah, forgot about that part. No, did I pick it up? No! I think I picked up the vacuum. Uh, can, can you just stop? Okay, there's one, another one to my top left. This one I will use at the end of 29 minutes that we get all the experience. Wait a second. No, I need to do this now, right? There's one to the bottom left. I, I'll do it now with the growth bonus. There is... I think I got it. And with the full bonus. Okay, how far... That was it? No, no, no. It's because we went into the, 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 the ball, right? The, the universe. Yeah. This will continue now, right? Yeah, okay, there we go. I think I just have to collect all the experience at this point. I will just manually do it. There shouldn't be that much around. Um, how long will you continue leveling up, by the way? This is why I kicked it off early. I can't press escape. I don't even know where the vacuums are or anything. Help, I'm stuck. Step bro, why do you leave me alone? Uh, okay, that is really not helping right now. <laughs> There's a reaper. Hi, reaper. How are you doing, mate? Can you just stay frozen? I have something to do right now, please. That would be really nice. I'm not even sure if he can hit me and trigger the shroud because he's so fast. There's a good chance that he simply can't. Wait, I think... No, he's frozen, right? Yeah, he's frozen. Okay. 1,263. Boy. But we are not done yet. We have the revivals. So I just heard the shroud, I think. I'm pretty sure. But I don't know how to kill the reaper here. I hope that bumping into him will somehow kill him. Otherwise, this will take ages. We did it! We did it! Oh my god. Okay, it's starting. W where's the pause menu? There. What was that sound? Did you hear that? The explosion? The bzzz. Was it the, 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 the thing? Okay. Okay. Let's go. Let's go. Kill me. I've never been more excited to see you. Hello, my friend. Goodbye. Got the sound effects. We have 260,000 HP. 238,000 HP. 261,000 HP. 288,000 HP. 316,000 HP. 348,000 HP. And this is the last one. Three hundred eighty three thousand HP. Are you ready? Jesus Christ. Four point nine G on a no future. What? Look at the pathetic crimson shroud. <laughs>